Well, with the help of their customers, one local business has found a way to keep their doors open and employees working, all while distributing food to frontline workers. News Channel's Tavon Sharifi has more on this effort. We would love to be able to donate food right now, but because we are upside down, it's not a possibility. Instead, the Pastry Swan Bakery is taking customer donations to distribute plant-based meals to frontline workers in the valley. We've gone to Eisenhower Hospital three different times, and we've gone to the Palm Desert Sheriff's Station once. The doors of Pastry Swan are open for takeout orders here in Rancho Mirage, and donating $12 helps provide a meal to frontline workers. Sometimes they might just pick up something small and say, you know, add the $12 on for meal, and we just keep adding those till we get 10 meals. Once they have 10 meals, they are ready to deliver them. Shannon outlines it as the CV Healthy Heroes initiative. Plant-based food is the, one of the best ways to boost your immune system and keep yourself healthy. Also working with Chef Tanya in Palm Springs to divide and conquer. Because she's also a plant-based chef. And so she's um, covering Palm Springs in that area, and then we're doing Rancho Mirage over in the valley. Deborah says the city of Rancho Mirage has also been a huge help in keeping things afloat. The thankfulness when they go to the doors and deliver this food, um, you know, you just don't realize how many people out there who really need help. And hopefully we can do a little bit to, to get, that, get that out the door to them as well. Thankful to the community for their ongoing support. Very grateful if it wasn't for our community. I don't think we would be open right now, especially trying to make it through the summer. So just this last month has, you know, been a day-to-day -day type of a, a, a deal. It's a win-win situation. It helps businesses that are struggling, and it also really helps those people on the front line stay healthy. Taban Sharifi, News Channel 3.